Welcome back. Another episode of Celtics, my GM. Now, we are in a very tricky situation. We're kind of in a rebuilding phase, but we still got guys like Al Hortford, Jay Crowder, um, even a Marcus Smart, who can, who are very good caliber NBA players. Once uh, Reddick comes back, our starting five will be pretty solid. If you look at the teams right now, or they're not the teams, the playoff picture, we are only two wins away. So if we get on a hot streak, we could definitely make the playoffs. I'm by no means am I. That's my expectation. I don't expect us to make the playoffs right now. If you look at 21 games, there are four people, a few at 19. So really, if a few teams get hot or a few teams get cold, it's going to completely shift how the Eastern Conference looks. The only teams that look like are going to guaranteed be in the playoffs, Cleveland, Philly, Indiana, and probably Washington. So, every other team is fighting for a playoff spot. If you look at the team right now, in terms of contracts, nobody wants to leave. Peyton's undecided. We just signed him or just traded for him. That's why. Most likely, he's going to want to sign back. I don't see why he would want to not. And Al Hortford, his morale is a little bit bad. He's feeling okay for the time being. But he's going to get a lot more touches now. I expect that morale to go up. Team chemistry, that 52. I expect that to blossom as well. Considering we're going to have nobody arguing over playing time. Look at the team. We, we got incredible depth. Just minutes shared all over the place. The only guy I could potentially see getting mad is maybe like a... Brown, a Jalen Brown. If he does, we can slot him into shooting guard while Redick is injured. I don't think he will, though. He hasn't complained thus far. Allen, we moved uh, Hortford to power forward for the starting of the game to allow Allen the starting role and big minutes. He's going to have to carry the minutes along. He, he's just going to have to. If he gets injured, that's going to suck. But we really have nobody else to give those minutes to. I mean, look at the team. Basically, we only have two got one guy, one guy available that is not playing. So, Hollis Jefferson, how long? He's looking to test the open market eventually, but he's only 23. Don't have to worry about that just yet. One to two weeks, and Redick, two to four weeks. So, who knows? I'm going to simulate up to the uh, deadline here. Why not? I'll go a, I'll go a day before the deadline just to make sure I don't skip it. Okay, congratulations. Level 15. Players recover 2% quicker. That's going to help out a lot right now. Perfect. Goal completed as well to sell out. Yeah, so we looks like we're losing a fair amount of games. Nothing. Alan, I just fucking said... He might not be handle or be able to handle the minutes we gave him. Fuck. Okay, I moved Hortford back to center. I moved Green to power forward. Damn, every... Ah. Uh, doesn't look like we're going to catch up now. We got three guys injured. Fuck. Not look... I don't know what the problem is. I'm getting injuries all the freaking time. Can't believe it. No, ah, uh, that's kind of interesting, Tyler, this could work out in our favor, but I don't want to take on both contracts at three years, 17 million for Noah, 20 million for Derek Rose, no thank you, I do like it though, I do like uh, getting a bit more depth, but yeah, now we're four wins out of a playoff spot. Our only hope is if Reddick comes back early. Richardson isn't happy with the performance against to the old team. Suck it up. <laughs> That's all I can say to that. 
We need to scout a lot. We got, well, not a lot, actually. I don't, do we have, I don't think we have second round picks, but we might trade Hortford at the draft. I'm not too sure. We have to keep him. We have to, we have to keep some form of, um, of a team. Like, we can't just totally bail out. Hollis Jefferson is now healed, so that's perfect. Okay. Let's take a look at what we're going to work with here. Okay, I do like what they're going with. Smart at shooting guard and Lawson at point guard. I like it. I like it. Then we can kind of hide Richardson a little bit. I didn't think of that. Good good on your game. <laughs> good on your coach. So, Lawson, Smart, Crowder, Green, and Hortford. That's going to look a little bit better once Allen and Reddick come back. Of course, uh, hoping we don't have any more injuries. Brown, Jefferson, Peyton, Dudley, and Lasbier. Come on, Reddick. How much longer are you gone for? Day to day. Perfect. Perfect. It's only day to day for him. Let's actually just simulate kind of a day to day now. Training intensity too low for Beasley. That's interesting. Okay. I can give you a little bit more intensity if you'd like. Simulate up a few more days. Hopefully Reddick's available. Richardson would also like a little bit increase in intensity. It makes sense. They're not playing right now. You know, extra training. Not gonna hurt them. Come on, Reddick. Come on. Are you back yet? What's his um, overall at? Still at 69. Day to day. So he can't play yet. It looks like he's gonna be good for post um post a uh, deadline. We gotta win against the Grizzlies. Any update on um Reddick? Still day to day. Shit, I don't know what that means. I'm guessing the the All Star Weekend break is gonna help him out a lot. We got Toronto here. Team status. Increase for the for him as well. Okay. Yeah, with the new um rotation, a lot of these guys aren't playing anymore, so it makes sense that they'd want a little bit more intensity. I'm okay with that. Let's simulate real time against Toronto here. We blew a huge lead. Holy shit. Well not a huge lead, but we were in control. That's too bad. Simulate through Indiana. Can we get a win at least? Can we get a win against Indiana? Come on. Come on, get a win against Indiana here. Reddick has healed. Perfect, perfect, perfect. There we go. His morale is down. His morale is going to go up, though. He has nothing to um get mad about now. He's going to get playing time. His morale is down under 50%. That is why his overall is only a 74. But, looking at his stats, he's, he has a great shot. Hopefully, he can start scoring a lot of points. I'm going to move Marcus into the starting position. And then we got Reddick, Crowder, Dudley, and Hortford. Dudley's a little bit... He's the only one I have a problem with. But we're going to have to roll with it. We just have to. We definitely have a little bit more depth. A little bit. That's not saying too much right now. That's really not saying a lot at all. But... <laughs> It is what it is. Gonna move a bit of minutes down. Gonna give him to the starters here. There we go. Can we beat Indiana now that we have Reddick back? Continue simulation and we lose again. Shit. Lasbier wants to uh, increase intensity as well. Didn't we just do him? I thought we did. Maybe not. Never mind. We didn't. My bad. Okay, time to simulate. Hopefully, this is going to give the team much needed rest. Much needed rest. Peyton, he wants the intensity up as well. Yeah, all the young guys, they're not playing a lot. Again, I'm just going to go by what they need. I'm not going to try and do it manually all the time. Simulate another day here. Perfect, Allen. We have a healthy team. That's huge. Huge. 
obviously right now we're we are way out of a spot. But in terms of the division, three wins away from third place in the conference. Yeah, we're definitely going to have to jump up. I don't expect us to, but it would be a nice treat if we could make the playoffs. Give the young guys a little bit of experience. Once you get there, anything can happen, obviously. So, here we go. The team's shaped out now. Please, I beg you, 2K gods, don't rain down with an injury. Please, don't rain down with an injury. I'm not going to give anybody too much minutes. I do want to give Crowder and Hortford around 30 minutes, though. Redick, his minutes can go up as well. Like, guys like Brown, Hollis, Jefferson, I don't want the minutes to be too high. I'd rather give it to guys like Lawson and Green. Gonna lower Allen a little bit as well. Now that we have Allen, actually, we can now move him to power forward. Or we're gonna move Hortford to power forward. Allen can play his natural position at center. Perfect. The minutes are a little bit more spread out now. That is good. Let's take a look at what trades have gone on in the league. Go to trades Tyler Johnson, Ibaka for Blazemore. The Warriors making a lot of moves. Powell was traded. We got Bayless for Rondo. Okay, Deladova for Mozgov. Um, Lance Thomason and Rudy Gay got traded. So the league's shaping up a little bit. The Nets and the Rockets both have new um, coach hiring. Coach transition. Huh, okay. I like that. I like how you can see all that. Wait. So the Nuggets re-signed the head, the head coach? Wait, can we do that? Can we do that? Player contracts. Can you not? Can I do that? Let's go to the coach here. Me? I don't know. Does his, his morale is at an 87. It's really good. That's interesting. I wonder... Huh. Okay, that's interesting. If you know how to re-sign him, let me know. I'd love to do that. The team's healthy. I'm not going to make a trade. Let's just keep going. I don't know what to expect at all. Let us look at business for a quick second. We're selling out every game. I'm going to move parking up just a tad bit. It's a mix. Owner trust goes up a little bit. Um, blue is home, is it not? I think blue is home. I'm pretty sure. Okay, so the trainer... That it doesn't feel like we're pushing the guys hard enough. Really? That's interesting. The overall workload is very high. But they are getting rest after and before a back-to-back -back medium. Okay, I'm going to go rest, no rest, before. Yeah, rest after but not before. Hopefully, hopefully I can take my trainer's advice and it actually works, I hope. Gonna scout a little bit more. The team's looking bright. The future is bright. I think we got a dynasty in the making here. Allen is gonna be an amazing center. He's gonna be a 90. We got a ton of B potential players. Oh my god, this is fucking insane. This is just insane. What is going on? I can't believe it. We need a better trainer for sure. God, now we got another injury. Can't believe it. Who, Who's going to play now? Are we, should we just um, shorten the bench down a little bit? I don't want to do that, though. I'll give Peyton a little bit of time, I suppose. I suppose. I don't, I don't even know what to do, to be honest. Shit. That's not good. We get a loss against Philly and against the Cavs and against the Magic. Wow. I'm going to boost up the morale of the players. Chemistry's going up. Chemistry's definitely going up. Let's take a look at business. Did we sell out again? We did, but the profit the profit went down a little, a little bit. That's not too good, but 
it is what it is. I don't really know what to what to think of the team. The practices are too easy for Brown. Okay. I can work with that. Where's Brown? There he is. Too easy for you? I guess so. You better not get injured. If you get injured, I'm going to slap you. Holy fuck. I'm not going to change the game plan. Peyton's injured day to day. Can he play through it? No, he can't. Okay, that's okay. I mean, that's what happened though. We had to give him we had to give him minutes. I mean, what else are we going to do, really? Uh shit. Okay, rest you. I guess we can give it to a few guys down here. I guess. Yeah, we're not going to make the playoffs. Definitely not. I don't see us going on a 10-game win streak. That's what's going to happen. Or what's going to have to happen if we're going to make the playoffs. I don't think so. I mean, you never know. We could get on a roll. I'd, I'd appreciate it. I definitely like my team to do good. <laughs> no doubt about that. Is it going to happen? Probably not. Let's give Peyton a good amount of minutes here. Give him 13. What the game thinks we should give him. I'll give two to him. I guess. I don't know. Why not? Reddick has been injured day to day. He can play through it and I am going to make him. I definitely need him in the lineup. I don't know how long he's going to be injured for though. We get a big win over Oklahoma. Another big win over Indiana. Reddick is back. He's 76 overall. His morale is finally back to how it should be, I hope. What's it at here? Where is it? Okay, it's going past 50. Perfect. He is getting a little bit injury prone. His ankles have a high risk of injury. Not good. Not good at all. We, I might decide to opt out of the deal we have with him. I don't know if I should, though. What do I want? Do we have anything for strength? Yep, I'm going to do strength. Perfect. Hopefully, now the guys won't get injured. No, we're getting on a win streak and Crowder gets injured. Oh my god. He can play through it. I'm going to make him play through it. I do think it will last. I definitely do. I'm going to say that. Damn. So Crowder's been injured right as we get on a five-game win streak. Nothing can go right. Nothing can go right. Oh, my God. We're only four wins out of a playoff spot, too. That could not have come at a worse time. Our team is in limbo. Holy shit. We can't make the playoffs, but we can't completely just bust. Damn, I don't I don't know what to do here. Okay, coaching. I guess Jalen Brown, you're gonna be starting. Crowd is Crowd is gonna be coming uh, coming off the bench. I will give him reduced minutes for sure, but he needs to play. He has got to play. On top of that, we're gonna have to give some more minutes down here. I'm going to give him to Richardson. We need we need another shooting guard to come in. We got four minutes to hand out. I'll give it to these guys. Hortford, yeah. Hortford, you need to step up and play a, a, a little bit more. Yeah, Allen, you can play a little bit more as well. They say that he should be playing um, 30 minutes a game. I don't know about that. I'll give him 25. 25 is what I will give him. There we go. I don't know what to do. If you know, we only have one. We got one, two, three, three and a half weeks to hopefully make the playoffs. If you have any idea what I should do, let me know. Because I don't know what to do. If you think I should increase or decrease anything on this page, let me know. If you think I should manually do the timeline let me know